Hi everybody, this is Parker from testpropchampions.com and in this video I'm going to go over another GED math practice problem, solve the equation for x. So go ahead, pause the video, try it out on your own first. Okay, hopefully you had a chance to go over this on your own. If not, I'm going to cover it right now. So this is the very fundamental skill for the GED test and the way it works is we want to get the variable by itself. And the variable is this x right here. So we get the x by itself on the left hand side of the equation and we've got the problem done. So the first thing to focus on is this 30. So we look at the addition sign here, and so we know that in order to get the 30 from the left-hand side of the equation to the right-hand side of the equation so that we can get the x by itself, we have to do the inverse operation. So the inverse of addition is subtraction. So if you've got $0 and I give you $100, okay, and then you spend that $100, you've just undone it and you're back to zero, right? So that's the inverse. So that's all I mean by inverse. So if we've got plus 30, we do minus 30, we're down to zero. And so whatever we do to one side, we have to do to the other. So 30 minus 30 is zero, and 48 minus 30 is 18. And so now we rewrite this, we bring that 3x down. So we've got 3x equals 18. And so now what we want to do is we want to get the x by itself. So 3x is 3 multiplied by x. So the inverse operation of multiplication is division. Okay, so we want to divide by 3 on one side, and what we do on one side, we do to the other. So now we do 3 divided by 3, that gives us 1. 1 times x is just x. 18 divided by 3 is equal to 6. So the answer then is just x equals 6. And that's the video for today, guys. This is a very, very, very crucial skill to master for the GED. Uh, you're going to get questions like, you might get questions just like this, but also for word problems, for geometry, for basically all kinds of different math questions, you're going to have to know how to isolate variables. So if you have trouble with this, I have a whole other video that I've made that explains how to do this step by step. So you'll want to check that out. But thanks for watching, guys. Please give me a thumbs up if you found this helpful. And don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss anything. Thanks, guys. Good luck.